G'day everyone, welcome to Extra Sart. I'm Chrissy. thanks for joining me today. I just want to make sure that all sound is good. Just one moment. Uh, and that picture is good. Just one moment. Just one moment. Oh, hello, Christy. How you going? How you going? Just one moment. Okay. All right. Let me see. I'm just getting the chat up. Make sure that that's all working okay. All right. All right. Well, I'm back doing uh, my fantasy landscape. It is a forever... Um, you know, it's just taking a very long time, but that's okay because I am taking my time. And today I'm going to be working on uh, the grass area here and see if I can uh, keep on moving along. Of course, I've had projects in between which you may have seen or may not have seen. I'm not sure, uh, but um, just I'll make sure that the chat is working. Um, okay. It's there. It's okay. All right, well, I'm just going to um, going to go ahead and um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Um, okay. All right, I hope everyone's had um, um, a pretty good week so far. Uh, you know, work or art or whatever it keeps people busy so uh g'day rob hello john how you going how you going how you going hope hope you are all well today i'm just looking at my reference and i'll be working on here um Janice, hello, hello, how are you going? Nanette, hello, how are you going, how are you going? Wendy's not far away, folks, so. Um, hello, I'm not drinking, I swear. <laughs> Oh dear. Okay, all right. I'll take your word for it, all right? Janice? Okay. Well, I'm about to start drinking. Well, hang on a sec, Nanette. You're not going to drink all on your own. But mine's a boring drink at the moment. <laughs> it's just some juice, actually. And there's nothing in it. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, your, uh, um, uh, Gemma says, oh, uh, you're starting where you left off, Chrissy. <laughs> yes, I am. That's exactly, you're very observant, <laughs> Janice. <laughs> yes, I have. That's exactly right. I haven't touched it. It just keeps on looking at me. So what I'm going to do is just like these little, they're like little specks. And um, it's going to take such a long time, but see how we go. Maybe, oh yes, maybe I should hack up another brush. Oh, to speed up the process. Oh, that's an idea. Should I do that? I... Okay. 
Maybe I should hack another brush. Actually, that's right. I should do that. Um, Lindy, hello, hello, Silky, hello, hello. Christy says, um, I loved your fixatives video. It really showed how it affects the paper and mediums. I think I'll stay away from them now that I've seen the results. You know, and I was actually going to talk about that today because don't we always get that question or don't it's always or someone is asking it and um, and I thought that video where I I when I took those photos um, I love this video too oh thank you Silky um, I, I'm gonna make a cup of coffee now are you sure you're gonna make a cup of coffee Rob <laughs> well it's actually very early in the morning it's very early in the It's, is it two in the morning for you? Oh my goodness. Um, it had to, it'd have to be, wouldn't it? Um, okay. So with, sorry, uh, talking about the, um, the, those fixatives, when I took that photo, like I waited for a while for those. Oh, what, when I say a while, um, I don't know, about an hour or waiting until it dried. And it still looked wet, didn't it? Um, and that's the thing. Uh, it's one. It's one. Uh, it's one a.m. Okay, here. All right. Well, you're not going to believe it, Rob. I actually went to bed about three thirty in the morning, and I, I uploaded that video around that time, or well, three o'clock. It was. I think it was three o'clock or something like that. So, who cares about sleep, right? <laughs> Um, but yes, uh, with those fixatives, so interesting, isn't it? So interesting. And you know what? All of those brands, they're artist quality brands. They're like, they're not, it's not hairspray or, um, well, presumably non-archival, but you know, I mean, I've put everything away. Um, or maybe, um, later I can actually show you, um, a day later because uh, I've only just got them behind me. I haven't put those uh, those examples um, away for good. Uh, they're just sitting on my chair over there. And I was just thinking, wow, you know. And yeah, so people ask the question, should I use fixative? Heck no. Not, heck no. Heck no. No, 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 no. Uh, but that's me. Okay, that's me, right? But the only time I would... You know what there are times when you could probably use a fixative but where that would happen and I don't know it's for the the mixed media people who um, who th that would be where I would be using it if the two mediums are gonna have problems you know coming together like do you know what I mean um, so that's the that's the place where I would use it and I use I use the fixative when I'm uh, when I'm painting um, on canvas, um, and I put my drawing on with graphite, and I just give it a good spray with th the fixative. And of course, my drawing doesn't um, well; it's fixed, and it doesn't blend in. You know, the graphite when it blends in with the paint, and it leaves that horrible, yucky graphite, and it just changes the color of your paint. So that would be the time when I would use the fixative. But as far as pastel work. Or color pencil work a, a resounding no no way um, I had to refresh Chrissy uh, Chrissy's mouth was moving and the sound was like five seconds later oh is it okay still uh, these videos were awesome you saved me from spending money on art supplies I don't need absolutely I'm gonna be sitting on the dead zone where I can watch this but can't use internet to chat so if I'm quiet that's why no worries Lindy thank you for letting me know that you're so sweet um, does anyone um, does anyone have a good UV fixative for watercolor? If I don't want to frame my work behind glass, um, you know what? That um, I'm not quite sure about watercolor. I'm going to have to have a look at the directions on that tin again, on that can. But the one that I like is that Coty one. Now I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it correctly. Coat, Coty, K O T E. Not sure, not sure, but it's um, out of all of them, that would be the one that I would go with, to be honest. 
if I was to advise someone and I'm not even going to 100% recommend it because it still did leave something you know it still left a little something but then again it all depends how lightly you spray it it all depends how far you're spraying it um, you know it's all of that stuff you know Uh, but I'll have to have a look. Um, Silky, I don't know. I wonder if that one is. I just wonder. Yeah. Okay. And of course, like, you know, Windsor and Newton. Um, um, Windsor and Newton, which is like a very, um, you know, it's an artist brand but see that that can that you see that's for fixatives for like for uh, for pastels but they've also got in a can varnishes for um, like for paints which I use I prefer to use a spray can and Windsor and Newton have that and all those cans look the same so be careful when you're purchasing um, like if you're fixative make sure that you're not picking up the um, <laughs> the varnish um, because yeah 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 so So these are very teeny, 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 weeny little highlights. And I've got something dark as well. Where are my dark ones? My dark wood thing. Yeah. Uh, Oksana, hello, welcome, welcome. Letitia, hello, hello. Chrissy, how close are you finished to this one? Well, I think, um, I'll tell you what I've got to do. Uh, how close? Uh, probably about another 20 hours, I'd say. 20 hours. About 20 hours. Um, I'd say 20. I'm hoping that it's just 20, between 20 and 30 hours. Chrissy, are you able to turn your volume up a bit? Oh, okay. Let's have a look. Hold on. Um, let's see, is there something here? Okay. Is that better? Is that better? No, it's not better. Okay. Is that better? Um, oh, Wendy's Wendy's here. Hi, Wendy. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Now, is that better? No? Sound. What have I got? Sound. Only a bit better. Hmm. Wow. What have I done? Have I done something? Yeah, I've turned I've turned it up on my OBS, but um, oh, geez, um, okay, uh, maybe I should bring my microphone closer to me. Maybe is that? Hey, Would, yeah, it was that better now? That could be better. Oh, that's better, says Janice. Oh, okay, so, okay, all right. So Wendy's, um, yeah, so just mine, this is just my microphone here, so I've got it here very close. Um, Wendy's whispering sweet nothings in my ear, so um, she's around. Okay, that might be better. All right. 
I thought it was just me. Okay, Nanette. Sorry. Sorry, folks. Sorry, folks. Yeah. Might have to talk louder. Maybe I have to talk louder. Maybe it's a setting on this one. I'm not sure. I don't know. You know, sometimes I don't do anything to these blasted computers. I don't know what happens. I have um, computer fairies that just like to... Um, Plus, um, I have to finish this as quickly as possible, so I might, um, uh, I'm also designing the back of the card, so that's, that's what might interfere with this one again, but that's okay, I'm just going to be on it this time. I can't let anything else uh, distract me. I've got to finish it, that's it. Um... The volume on my iPad is all the way up, but you sound fine now. Okay, so it's it's Janice, it's not me, it's you. I'm not quite sure why. I'll have to figure it out off stream one day. I wonder if um, it's my... um. Hang on. No, there's no volume control. Yeah, it's, I'm sorry. Uh, um, I have her on my TV and I had to go up to 95 for volume. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's me. Yes, I do. I have, um, I'm on slobs. Um, I'm just checking. Computer volume. Oh, okay. All right, let me see. Speakers, no. Um, oh, no. No. Is that working? It's all about you, Chrissy. I think it is. <laughs> Nanette. Um, Oh, okay. Nothing's okay. Is it high? Yeah. Okay, when do... Oh, God. Okay. I don't know. What have I done? Have I done... Okay, let me just check the sound. Uh, <laughs> let me just check the sound. I don't know where else to check it. Um... Okay, oh, okay. Uh, um, okay, no, still. Is that better now? Is that better? No, it should, no. Oh, okay. Is it difficult to hear? Um, oh, hang on. Maybe. Is that better? No. No. Because I put a mic on my camera up there, but I don't think it should have anything to do with it. It's been okay sounding for me. Okay. All right. Um, just keep on letting me know. I have the volume to 100%, but it's okay to hear. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh gosh, Nanette, so funny. Uh, I'll probably jump out of my screen when I change a channel. I don't know, I'm going to have to do something with my settings. I don't know what's happened all of a sudden. I don't know. I just don't know. Yes, I, oh, yes, I did. Hi, um, hi, Sergio. Uh, all hail my ever, ever loving insomnia. <laughs> yes, I understand that. That's okay. Okay. All right. I don't know what it is. I've got everything full bore here, so it's something that I've done. I'm pretty sure it's something that I've done. <laughs> I'm so oh, 
gosh. Okay. Well, I might have to just scream then. I have to talk real loud. How about that? If I talk loud, would that be okay? Yes, yeah, so I'll have to talk loud. I have to talk loud. All right. I will do, I will do that. Okay. Uh, I'm going I'm going to fix a drink. Uh, you have been warned. Okay. <laughs> all right, no problems. No problems. Um, all right. So I better get back into this. Um, also, I need a few other colors. Here we go. Um, oh, okay. All right. I don't know what it could be. Um, okay, is that a much better? No, no. Testing. Hello. Um, I want. Uh, I wouldn't want to miss it. Okay, you are always okay. You was on the low. Okay, this. Oh, okay. Um, I wouldn't want to miss it. I just received the other day my first luminance pencils and haven't stopped smiling like an idiot ever since. Oh, look, I understand. No, no, you're not smiling like an idiot. This is the normal reaction one gets when gets art supplies. Uh, I think that's what I think. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, so we were talking about the fixatives. Yeah. And you know what too, the um I found uh I found using the uh like the canvas was really unusual. Uh and there was one where it was uh talking about the the Koti K O T R E uh has um a thing with inks. So that's something to think about for people that use ink. Uh, they could, um, you know, that fixative would be good for ink. So, and you know what? When I used it, I couldn't tell. I couldn't. I couldn't tell the difference between between the ink where I sprayed and where I didn't. So, I'm actually going to have a look another in another day or so and see if I can find a, a um, you know, uh, if there was a difference in a shift color change. Um, yeah. Could you every now and again let me know if the sound is like, if, if it's bad, if it's getting worse. That's probably what I probably need to, every now and again. It would be great if you could let me know. And so far, I haven't needed to use. So far, I haven't used pastels. Like, sorry, so, um, uh, pastels, soft pastels, as opposed to pan pastels, because pan pastel is a soft pastel. So, but pastel sticks. How about that? Um. The more I drink, the better you sound. <laughs> oh man, oh man, you're so funny, Nanette. You make you make me laugh. Honestly, you make me laugh. Hang on, I'm coming out of the picture here. Am I am I too far out of the picture, or am I this? This is. Hang on. Is that better? I think I'm. Am I too far out of the picture? Can you see? Am I too far out of the picture? Wendy? Oh. Half of me? Can you see half of me? What do I... Okay. It's that way. Because my microphone is that way. So if I move my microphone this way. My uh, webcam this way. This might be better. I don't know. Um, have a look in a few minutes. Um, is there a new group challenge yet or uh, will there 
be soon. Um, I forgot what the next one was going to be. Uh, we're doing eyes, Rob. We're doing eyes, this one. I find them uh, very creamy and pigmented, but firm too. Uh, doesn't, doesn't make sense, I know. This is the luminance, yeah. Um, oh, oh, sorry. The, oh, are we, oh, okay. I've missed the bit of... Oh, okay. Sorry. So am I in the shot? I'm not sure if I'm in the shot. Uh, where is your friend visit? Oh, okay. Sorry, that's not me. can't wait for the new 28 pencils to be complete yes I can't wait either you know what um, uh, Silky I went looking I thought that you could buy the 28 um, singularly but no you can't so I have to wait Um, Silky says, Chrissy, I had, I heard that they will be released next month. Oh my goodness. Oh, well. Yes. Is all I can say. Yes, yes, yes. I want to use my magic brush. Mm. Hang on a sec, let me get it. Okay, let me see. Does it sound still bad? Yep. Can, yeah. Um. Oh, that's better. I might have to check my sound after the stream. I won't do it now because I'll probably mess something up. But if you can bear with me, um, I'll make sure that the next time I stream that it won't be... Uh, yeah, I'm going to check my settings. I think 
Wendy was too. Oh, hey Heidi, hello. Bit late, but uh, better late than never. No, you're just in time. Um, you live in uh, Transylvania, wow. Oh, who lives in Transylvania? Oh, Sergio. Oh, I actually live in Transylvania, and believe me, besides some scary local ghoul legends and the fact that I've that I live near a graveyard, anyone is pretty veg everyone is pretty vegetarian regarding him. <laughs> Gosh. Well, it looks like this brush is here to save the day, I think. Yeah, this is my favorite brush. I think I I think I have to vote this one as my favorite brush at the moment. It's um my yeah, my favorite oh yeah, no, cuz I've got a few good brushes. My favorite textured brush. How about that? Okay, Silky, um, I have to go now, but I have to be back in time to enjoy the rest of the stream. Okie dokie, talk to you soon. Thanks for popping by. G'day, Gary. Hello, mate. How you going? How you going? Okay, hang on. I'm just trying to get... Um just just having a look at my pastels what do I need more greens I think more greens all kinds of greens actually Um, where is Transylvania, says Rob. Is it Romania? Is it? It is Romania, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at that. Tell you what, this textured brush has um, <laughs> saved me from a lot of work, I think. Uh, I'm going to put a lot of layers on this, though. I'm not quite sure if you can see this. Hang on, I'll just make sure you can. You can't. You can't. I'm not in the shot. Okay, hang on a sec. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, my microphone is just here, so bear with me. I'm trying to get it as close to... Uh, she's going to murder another brush. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> um... Well, don't buy fixatives. <laughs> oh, uh. Uh. You guys are awesome. Experience has spoken. sort of uh, let me see if I can push this forward maybe oh. where is this now yeah there we go
lot of layers is going to go on this area here. Yeah. So, yeah, don't buy fixatives, Janice. Um, I forget November is only a few months away. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. And we've got one more month of winter. Oh, gosh, I can't wait for it to go. Bring on summer, please. And I probably shouldn't complain because uh, you guys have been telling me that the, the no a normal temperature in winter time is just like something else. And I mean, our winter time here during the day has been like twenty degrees <laughs> during the day. Oh, yesterday was just awesome. Um. Uh, where, where are the footprints? Oh, are they, do, they, do they look like footprints? Oh, no, no, no. It's all grasses. Grasses, different grasses. And I'm just laying down some colour before because it's I'm going to build up and get lighter and darker wherever I need to. There'll be different pans being used. <clears throat> oh, hang on a sec. Just let me get the vacuum cleaner out. Sergio, um, my wine, I like a, um, I don't like sweet wine. Uh, the only sweet wine I'll have is musket, maybe at the end of the day or some port. But usually I like to drink uh, Shiraz. Um, it's called musket, yes. Uh, Wendy said to me, did you just call it musket? And I said, yes, I did. Musket. No, no, okay, Google it, musket, musket is, musket is more like, um, like an after dinner drink, it's more a dessert wine, that's what it is, and you, and it's served in a, a small glass, not in a wine glass, uh, for those who don't know what it is. Wine, um, Wendy's trying to give me a lesson on uh, what this is. I know what it is. I've been drinking it for years. <laughs> I'm telling you, it is called. No. Wendy's trying to tell me about musket and how it's pronounced and in different parts of the world. But I can tell you now, that's how we call it, okay? Musket. Or um, it's a, a dessert wine, but it's served as in like in a liqueur glass. It is, or a port glass. It is, a, or a dessert wine glass. But I don't like sweet wine as such. I'm more into uh, Shiraz. Um, I like... Um, uh, a, a cab sav, um, a cab sav. Um, oh gosh. Yeah. Mm. I just.
just want to make sure that you guys can see what I'm doing here. That's all. And is the sound... I'm almost going to have to start screaming, actually. I might have to start talking really, really loud. I hope that you can still hear me. It is spelt musket. There you go. M-U-S-C-A. Yes. Oh, is it spelt musket? Yes. Yes, it is. Oh. It's not Moscato. It's not Moscato. Uh, hello, Jacqueline. Hello, how are you? <laughs> welcome, welcome. Oh, we're going to have a debate of what musket is. Oh, I can tell you that. Let me have my juice because that's all I've got at the moment. It is. <laughs> Wendy's having an argument with me. <laughs> I think Chrissy. <laughs> Janice says, I think Chrissy needs a liter of musket. <laughs> Absolutely, I think I need it. After this dream, I will need it for sure. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Sergio says, all, uh, my, my all-time fave at the moment is the, oh, the Sangiovese type. It's a type of a rosé. I uh, found a local one with uh, some lovely uh, cherry blossom, rose petals and apricot tones. Sergio, I'm impressed. I like Sangiovese too. And are you, are you, um, and that's how we pronounce it. I hope that you pronounce it the same. Is that more, not more of an Italian brand or type of a blend or yeah the Sangiovese oh there's so many nice wines actually Tempranillo is a very nice which is an Italian one but we make it in Australia so yeah but I'm I'm gonna be told off <laughs> for sure um, <laughs> oh you guys crack me up oh okay well I crack myself up half the time like sometimes you know what you know what's really funny is that after a stream and after we've had a, a bit of a, a carry-on, I think about the stream sometimes and I'm thinking, did I really say those things? So I go back sometimes and I have a look and I'm going, oh my gosh. <laughs> it's different when I'm saying it, but then when I go back and I hear myself saying it, I go, oh my gosh, you idiot, I thought to myself. <laughs> but anyway. It's after the fact, so. All right, okay. <laughs> and Im Im I'm imagining what you guys are thinking when it's actually happening in real life. So that's it. Ah, uh, dear, oh dear, oh dear. Wow, look, that's coming along much. Oh, okay, all good, says Janice, okay. <laughs> Wow, I'm really liking how this is coming along. I'm glad I'm not going to do little bits and pieces of with pastel pencil because this brush is just doing the work for me. Honestly, if you guys are ever doing something... Yes. I'm just thinking, if, you, if you're ever doing a project like this, or it doesn't have to be like this, this size, but you know what? Invest in a brush that you can chop up, I reckon, and see what effects you can get when you're using this. Because, yeah, I'm being very naughty the way I'm using this. The pan pastels, they're not supposed to be like that. But anyway, they're doing what, they're doing what I want them to do. So hang on a sec.
Chrissy, I suppose there is no harm in borrowing different recipes and styles of beverages for the common good. Yes, part one. Okay. I um, Rob says, I sometimes think, did I really write that? Yes, see, this is what I mean. This is what I mean. Did I really say that? Did I really, really say that? But oh well, never mind. I'm sure you'll forgive me so long as I'm not being insulting or anything like that. Uh, great. Um, uh, I often think, oh, yeah, Nanette said that. Oh, no. Oh, sorry, Nanette says, me too. Um, sorry, Nanette, yeah. Oh, yeah, Nanette says that as well. Um, Chrissy, I used to work for a local beer company that produced their ale type of beers in Germany, but were so, so very well received by the local hipsters. Oh, okay. Would I be one of those hipsters? No. Oh, no. Maybe I like to think I am. Um, I used to work... Yeah. Um, I'm not into beer, I have to say. Uh, the only time I'll, I will drink some beer is um, on a hot summer day. Probably on a hot summer day, maybe after some... Uh, maybe working in the yard or just, you know, that's when I probably would like just a swig um, of beer but I'm not a beer drinker I'm not I'm <laughs> uh, yes well yeah Wendy's telling me I, I don't remember seeing you working in the yard my husband works in the yard and he walks around with a with a with a small bottle of beer around the yard but he's also a wine drinker as well so I think it all depends what he's doing. But for me, it, yeah, it all depends. But it's mainly on a hot summer day. Um, no, it's, it's, they're, they're like, no, no, they're little stubbies. I don't know what you call them. Like they're, you know, like they're 300 mil. 300 mil. I don't know how many fluid ounces is that. But it's a, like a little bottle. Like it's a little stubby bottle. Uh, Chrissy, during the hot summer days, I usually fuel up. Uh, my newfound obsession with Tom Collins. What's Tom Collins? My wife likes to watch, but she's upstairs. Oh, my, uh, but she's, uh, she's upstairs at the moment. Oh, okay. Um, uh, please explain Tom Collins. Is that a type of a beer? I mean, we have, we have lots of beers here. Um, we have Heineken's, we have, we have all the international beers, but we've also got the Australian beers, which, um, which Australians are very good at making and drinking. Yeah, about 12 ounces. There you go. Yes, that's... Yeah. No, no, I'm talking... No, no, I'm talking the 12 ounces. Uh, Foster's, yes! Fosters, exactly, Nanette, exactly. We have Fosters. Um, that used to be uh, my go-to drink, Tom, Tom Collins. Okay, is that a beer? It's got to be a beer. Oh, it's a gin and tonic. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, okay. I call. I is that what you call them? I also I call them a gin and tonic. Chrissy should really refrain from reading out aloud anything I type. <laughs> she bets it. <laughs> oh, what can I say? Where's some earphones? <laughs> Where's some earphones? <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, Sergio, Chrissy, a cocktail based of gin, lemon juice, sparkling water, and flavours. Uh, when I make it myself, I usually go uh, with elderflower, apricot, or raspberry. Oh my goodness, what a very nice recipe. Nanette, are you getting this one? I hope you are because this is a damn good recipe, this one. I like that. Australian for beer is what is what they say here. Okay, all right. Yeah. I'm impressed, Sergio. Wow. Sergio's 
said you, you must have a, a well-stocked bar. Yeah, you must have for sure, I reckon. Wow, I'm really liking how this is. Wow, yes, I like this. It sort of goes like this. Um, it sort of goes, and then that comes like that. So, but yeah. All right. I need dark there. Excuse me, just for a moment. I didn't think I'd need these colours, but obviously I always bring I should always have them out. It's my raw umbers, you know how it is. I should have them out. There we go. Sorry. Okay, um, the only time I actually ran out of wine, uh, my friend uh, was so shocked, my friends were so, my friend was so shocked uh, that each of them actually went out and bought a bottle for me. <laughs> oh dear. Vacuum cleaner out again. Um, I think you should have them out too. I was thinking. Okay, more green. Just building up on the greens as I'm going, so. Just here. Okay.
sorry. I just want, I just want to think it to seem more. Oh, no. There we go. Oh, which one was I using? It was this one. So as I'm moving this way, I'm going lighter and in certain areas I want highlights. Um, yeah. There we go. Well, this is moving faster. Thank goodness. I might end up finishing this side of it today. Uh, Chrissy, I hope you don't mind me being a loud mouth. All of you ladies could rep could represent motherly figures for me, and I do not want to present any form of disrespect to any. Oh, look, Sergio, of course not, my dear. Don't be silly. Go ahead. You're being you're being okay. You're being cool. <laughs> Okay, I like that trick. That trick works, actually. <laughs> trying to get this. Oh, there it is, the yellow. I'm after the yellow. There's just a little bit, a hint here. I like that. 
ってはいマイベストゥーズボードガイズハッドミはい。That trick is、um, a trick that、uh, I saw, and I think、um, Will from Unmask Art、uh, does. And I was on a live stream and I was trying to get speckles, and he says, Why don't you do that? And I went, Oh, I never thought of that. So I did it, and so when I,、um, and that's how I did it with those trees, just that little highlight there. Yeah, good trick, actually. Good trick. So I'm not going to press it on right now, but I will, I will as I'm building up the layers. I'll just hang on a sec. Oh, and before I forget, I just wanted to say thank you to Wendy for moderating the stream and hanging out and helping out with putting links in the description. Sorry, in the chat there. So I、uh, just wanted to say thank you very much to Wendy. And also, you know, I've got all of Wendy's、uh, social media sites in the description box below. So if you wanted to visit,、um, Wendy works on some fabulous stuff and always helps us. I love the cold. Grew up in MI, is that,、um, uh, and, uh, and would like to return there. MI. Where is MI, Nanette? Michigan.
what? Wendy hasn't done a thing tonight. <laughs> She's far too busy yapping with <laughs> with us. <laughs> well, that's the whole thing. That's the whole thing. You can't see on um, you can't see but this is actually quite lighter here I wish I could show you the color it is This is where I have to know when to stop to do this. I've got to know what to do there. I need darker. I need something darker, darker, darker. More contrast here down the bottom. It's all grass. That's what it is. It's all grass. Might go in and just with the pastel pencil and just do, just touch little things. You guys must be sick and tired of looking at this painting because if you're not I am <laughs> I'm sorry to put you guys through this I just no if you are okay no okay you must be si oh god now I've forgotten what Wendy's making fun of how I say things you guys must be sick of it because I'm sick of it well, not sick, but I mean, not sick of sick of looking at it. It must be. Yeah, forget it. Don't worry. Rewind. Forget what I said. Forget what I said. Yeah, I know. It's too late. I understand. <laughs> uh, too late. Yes, too late. <laughs> 
Hang, oh, hang on a sec. I don't think he meant that literally. Oh, okay. Uh, yes, uh, who was who said this one? Christy? Lindy. Yes, Lin yeah, Lindy, yes. It is the biggest one. I've done some big ones. I have done big ones, but this is the, the biggest one I've done. Uh, yeah. yeah, it is. Yeah. There's an ant. Is there an ant? There's an ant somewhere. There's an... Yeah, there's an... I don't know. There's an ant in my studio and it's climbing on my paintings and I see it every now and again and it visits me and I'm thinking, I wonder if you people can see it as well. I don't know. Like, strange creatures live in my art studio. Oh, dear. Yeah, that's right. Well, that's right. It's better than the snakes underneath my house. Yeah. We have possums. We have, we have all sorts of things. Yes, it is, uh, Lindy. It is like what you said. It is massive. So, but, but I tell you what, I have learnt so much. I have really, I have learnt so much. I've learnt, well, I've learnt that I could do this. I can learn. Yes, I've learnt how to get an effect uh, with hacking a brush. I've learnt. Uh, I've learnt a great deal of patience, more so than I normally have. Uh, I've learnt patience. I've, I've learnt patience because I'm not rushing this like I would normally rush something. And that's something. That's saying something. Okay, here we go. Um, how do you just yeah? Uh, good question, Rob. How do you decide what medium to use for a given piece? Uh, um, is it the final look that decides it for you, or is it what uh, you feel like working in look I tell you what um, it's a very good question I've been using these pan pastels for a long time more so than any other medium because I started this project and so I started this pro well actually I started the project with soft pastels and pan pa but all of it the whole gamut right um, but then I then when I started to learn different techniques uh, with brushes I let I lean towards the pastel because it was giving me you know that effect that I wanted or you know it was giving me the the detail that I wanted that I couldn't get with the soft pastels although you can get details with soft pastels because you use pastel pencils and all of that I, I get it but somehow I just you know it was just it was things were happening when I was using that technique so uh, but that's not to say uh, sometimes I'll look at something and I go, you know what, that'll, that'll look really good in oils or that would look really good in coloured pencil or, 
you know things like that or that would look good in watercolor my problem is is that getting masterful at it so I can make it look like I want it to look as it is in my head that's that's where I come unstuck but yes now that's a really good question I like that uh, your your possums your possums are much cuter than ours but um, I really want a wombat well you know what I have we have possums uh, we have possums in our backyard in the evenings they come in the evenings and you can hear them uh, jumping from tree to tree because we've got these golden palms in the pool area and you see them and they run along the pool area and then they jump I don't know why they do that like why, why do they jump and the only reason why I see that is because sometimes like in winter time we'll have a fire you know we'll have a and we all sit around a fire and there they go jumping around Uh, Heidi that's a very good question how do I decide uh, what size um, it all depends if the subject has um, a bit of detail or quite a bit of detail I would probably tend to go larger so I can get into those details uh, that's how I decide pretty much and so because I knew this painting there was a lot going on I didn't think that I was going to do it justice with something smaller so uh, that's why I decided to do this size honestly this is pastel matte board Janice uh, and um, quite sturdy I'm having no problems with it it's, it's fantastic for me it really is it really is fantastic I want this to blend in there. microphone is just there Moni, hello Moni, how are you going? I'm in or every time. Oh, okay, thank you so much. Okay, I think I will use the yellow for this. Where's the yellow? Where'd you go? Did I lose it? No. Nope. Right here.
forgot to press record. Oh, this would have been good for <laughs> the grass. This would have been good to make a nice little video of the grass. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh, well. So we've got eyes on our Facebook page. That's the new challenge. And I thought I'd put a, a mature eye and a young eye. And then I thought I'd put a, a loopy eye. A weird eye. For those who are wanting to do something a little bit different. So, so you're quite welcome to do that challenge because Rob mentioned that before earlier. Um, yeah so i love doing eyes but i've got to do things that um i've got to do things that i don't like doing and that's hands so don't worry i'll be keep on keeping on with that with that exercise so yes Wipe off the grass and start again, Lindy. Yeah, oh, yeah, right. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, that's okay. I'll probably get my hair in it anyway, so like I always do. Drives me nuts. I know, I should put it up. Yeah, yes. <laughs> oh, yes, it's been... Yes. Somehow, uh, I can't see her doing that. Mm. Yes. Okay. All right. I've also been thinking I've also been thinking about uh, the backs of the cards and I've started to design I've got a few thoughts in my head and I know I've been talking about it but um, yeah that's sort of close and um, I'm not sure I'm, I wanted to do about like I've mentioned before two or three options but uh, it all depends how the first one I do if I'm not quite happy with how it's going then I I might do three you know about three but certainly uh of course one but maybe two and i'm going to choose from there uh which one i'm going to go with so that's it's really interesting um really interesting because it's it's mainly going to be uh geometric type design uh so yeah and I've got the, the what I've got in my mind is using the um, the symbols of fire, you know, all of all of the elements, the symbols, uh, rather than the actual thing. So, yeah, um, and all sorts of borders. I've been because I've been having a look at different cards, and whilst I, you know. I was just seeing what what's around and how other people design them and it's really interesting there's so many so many possibilities so the eye in the tree has me wanting to do some fan well that's a good one it's 
um, Nanette, that's a really good one, isn't it? It's like it's um, I'm trying keeping with the um, with the eye challenge, and I thought, well, you know, how many eyes do we get to do all the time? I thought, let's just do something different. Let's just do something different. Actually, I need ochres here. try this brush um, let's see ah yes that's right you have Sergio yes you have <laughs> you have The brush seems to have helped me get through quite a bit of it, I think. So I'm jumping, um, it needs to be darker here.
find a brush that's... Oh. Hang on. Sorry, I'm just... I'm not getting something that I want here and I don't know... I'm going to have to... Let's see this. Now this is a pastel... Uh, like It's not a pastel brush, sorry. It's a um, stippling brush. But um, let's see if I can get what I want here. It's like a hog hair. A stencil brush, is it? I thought... Oh, okay. Yes. Sergio, Sergio, uh, the eye, uh, the eye, yeah, uh, Sergio says, considering the eyes I've worked, oh yeah, we've done that, I think sleep has finally, yeah, I think sleep has finally caught up to me, have a great stream ladies, and hope to see you soon again, uh, once again, sorry, soon once again, uh, thank you Sergio for popping by, um, always a delight to have you around, um, Sure, let's see what it looks like now. I want to cut this. This is what I want to do. Be time to butcher another brush. What do you reckon? I think I can. Oh, I want to make that pointy but hard. There, what shall we do? Okay, I'm going to chop this up. Well, I might use a blade. Let's go. 
Oh, here we go. Oh boy. Not good. This is not a good brush, yes, but what I wanted to do is make it pointy. And I think I may have to get some scissors to do that. Bear with Bear with me just for a moment. I'll be back and I'll just have to just get over there. Hang on a sec. Okay, here we go. Wish me luck. I don't even know if this is going to work. Oh, where did my brush go? <laughs> wanted to run away. Here we go. Hang on. It wanted to run away because it... Here we go. Let's just... Thank you, Silky. You're just in time because I'm butchering another brush. It's so tiny. Let's test this. I'm actually enjoying this to be honest. Ah, she's doing it again. Yes. Yes, I'm doing it again. So let's. But we're going to test it out. Let's see how we go. I want it to a, a finer point. <laughs> this here is a test brush. Mm, yes, it is that. You know, whatever works. I'm just trying to see. Uh, I'll send you a photo of a brush I have uh, that you may like. Oh, okay, Janice, that sounds good. <laughs> oh, gosh, okay. But, you know, let's have a go, see what happens. 
Whatever works, right? Yes. Okay. I'm putting the scissors aside. I'll vacuum because all the poor bristles have gone everywhere. And, and we'll, we'll, we'll give it a... We'll give it a test run, hey? But hang on a sec. Okay, let's give this a try. I think I need more of a point, I can tell. Yeah, I could use my pencils. That is correct. But I want... Um, the pencils don't give the... Because um, sometimes, like, you know how your brain ends up doing then the same stroke? But then with these, you don't end up doing the same stroke. Okay. Let's have a go. Let's see if, if the difference. So. Maybe. Then you know what? Your brain ends up doing the, the same thing. Well, I've got to hold my pen different. For that to happen. Pencil. Gosh. <laughs> Don't even know what I'm using. <sighs> okay. that is working for me ah yes mm, I like that um, Wendy's showing me that brush uh, Janice I sent you the photo of a brush yes okay yes something like that what's that is that a hog hair brush Janice that one is pointy enough and I can't get it pointy can't get it pointy enough oh well there goes that brush Synthetic but hard. Okay. Says Wendy. Okay. Oh, that, that what Jenna says. Okay. So, oh, it's synthetic but hard. Just right. Okay. Says Jenna.
good is glassine? You should see, I've got glassine all on here and then I've got my art supplies on top of my painting. Can't believe I've done that. That's how glassine is. It's fantastic. Oh, I'm just trying to decide now. I think, what time is it? up here And yeah, it goes like that. in that see what that's looking like
it's a scrubber okay that brush Janice thank you Thank you Janice that defines the slope yes the colors are that's exactly how it sort of like comes in a bowl like that wow this bit was actually terrifying me I wasn't sure how I'd go with it I always say things like that but it's true they're true yes, I'm, happy with it. I'm happy with the way it's going anyway absolutely Yes, I'm really pleased. Wow, this brush is something else, isn't it? Jesus creepers. Can't get over it. Now there are little, like little red, they're like a little red little flecks all the way through the grass. And they're little teeny weeny ones so uh, they're there because they're there anyway you ask you ask a silly question you get a silly answer that's what happens in Chrissy's world <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know I don't know. I don't know why these are there. I don't know why these are there. It could be, yeah. No, they're not small little flowers. They're like, um, I'm not sure what they are. We'll go with seeds. Oh yes, I really like how it's going. I'm sorry, I'm getting excited. I'm getting excited because this area just terrified me. I wasn't sure how I was gonna tackle it, I thought. Um, no, you're not mean to me. Are you mean to me? Who says you're mean to me? Oh, Tim, Tim is Wendy's husband. And he's saying that Wendy's mean to me. And um, uh, no, you're not mean water off a duck's back actually have you heard that term or are you gonna get uh, are you gonna are you gonna tell me you're gonna tell me that I'm not saying that right now Wendy no oh okay I'm good on that one <laughs> okay this bit here is sort of darkish and with a bit of green
Uh, Heidi says, Chrissy, you might have hit it on a new business sideline, but cheap brushes chop them up and resell them as an expensive uh, rate as uh, Chrissy's handmade pastel brushes. I like that idea. <laughs> oh, I like that idea. Absolutely. Oh, gosh. Well, let me have a... I'm just going to have... It's, this is only juice, folks, so there's, not, there's nothing even in it. Um, but let me have a look and see what's going on with this. Oh, hang on. Just let me vacuum that bit there too. Before I decide what I have to do here. I'm having a look at the camera because the camera, believe it or not, is showing distance. It's really weird how it does that. I don't understand how that happens, but it just does. Perspective, I'm told. It's, so this is, I want to, this is how I want it. And then that's sort of going up. I have to work on this area, I think. I'm going to let, let leave that alone for a bit. Add a few little dots here and there. Little teeny highlights, just teeny weeny ones. And start building here. And I might start getting into this area a little bit before I start moving this way. Wow, hasn't that taken a while? Okay. Um, all right. You know what? I'm. I might leave this. I might. What I might do is um, because I really need to walk away from this. So what I might do is I might just call this stream um, a stream. <laughs> and uh, it was a stream before I called it a stream. I'm always reminded of that, but that's how I call it. I uh, just wanted to say, oh, thank you so much for keeping me company. Um, I just love you guys hanging around. It's so nice. It's nice to... It helps the time go by really quickly, actually. And before you know it, boom. Um, and um, I really enjoy your company. I really love it a lot. And thank you so much for being around. And thank you to Wendy, who's always around and... Oh, let's, okay, let's see if, yeah, all right, let's zoom out as much as I can. Um, I wonder if I can. Oh, is that the other way? Yeah. Um, it's about as far as I can go. I might have to get rid of that. can't zoom out anymore um, it was great yeah um, thanks Chrissy always fun to watch you working and have company arting thank you so much uh, it was great to see you all Chrissy uh, says Silky can't wait to see this I can't wait to see this 
he's finished as well uh looks awesome okay thank you everyone um thank you all so much and i'll see you next wednesday okay bye for now